Hey, it's Adam with another What's New in Mix Effect. This time we're going to be covering Mix Effect 1.1.1, which I'm calling the Switcher Discovery Release. Without further ado, let's get started. This will be a very welcome feature for all Mix Effect users. Basically, when you go to create a new ATEM switcher and when the sheet appears, Mix Effect will detect all the ATEMs that are on your local network. So you don't have to try to figure out what the IP address is by going to ATEM setup on your Mac or PC. You just go say new ATEM switcher, you'll see all the ones that are on the network. So I have two, an ATEM Mini Pro and an ATEM Mini Extreme ISO. You just tap on them and it fills in the information. It fills in the IP address and the name, which you can change uh, the name. You don't want to change the IP address because that is the IP address of the ATEM. So if I said ATEM Mini Pro Home and I type add, this will add it to my list down here. And all I have to do is tap connect. And now I'm connected to my ATEM Mini Pro at home. And you can see this is the ATEM Mini Pro, it doesn't have super source. But if I go to the ATEM Mini Extreme and we'll just create a new ATEM switcher, we'll tap this one, call this one home, type add, we'll type connect. And we'll see now that we're connected to the ATEM that I'm recording this video on with the super source active right now. So something to keep in mind when you create a new switcher is that you may have to set your OSC settings back up again. If you've set up companion in your stream deck to talk to mix effect at a particular IP address uh, with a particular OSC port, uh, you may need to change that in either companion or set the OSC port to the right one when you're creating your switcher. Otherwise, you may be pushing your Stream Deck buttons and nothing's happening. And you're like, why is it not working? It's because the port is different or the IP address is different. So make sure you check your companion settings and your MixEffect settings for your switcher uh, whenever you create a new switcher connection in MixEffect. So what else is new? Uh, a lot of people have been wanting a way in SuperSource to go directly to the view all presets page because some people live in this view all the time. Now, ideally, I would have like a tab here that'd be like all and then presets, art, and copy. But there's a bug in Swift UI uh, and Xcode where if I add the view all presets page, it crashes when going to the other tabs. So as a workaround, I've done this kind of little hidden trick for MixEffect users watching this video. If you click or tap on the little Chevron icon here in the SuperSource navigation, watch what happens. It will take you to the View All Presets page. If you tap anywhere on the SuperSource area here, you'll go to the main page with the, with the tabs. You can always go to the View All Presets page still by tapping the icon in the upper right corner as before. But if you wanted to go straight to that page when you're in going, say, from the switcher to here, all you have to do is tap that little Chevron icon and you go to the view all presets page. There's also a command shortcut for that. It's command option shift S. So command shift S goes to super source, but command shift option S goes to the view all presets page. Mix effect comes localized now in Chinese and it already had German and Polish. So if you are using mix effect in Chinese, you can just switch that. It's in settings in the settings app. Go to mix effect and choose uh, languages here. And then now you'll see it will mix effect will restart and it'll be localized in Chinese here. So the localization strings for mix effect are available on GitHub. I'll put a link in the show notes below. So if you want to see mix effect localized in your language, I encourage you to go to GitHub and submit a pull request. Um, there's a lot of languages that are listed there and I need help to get mix effect localized in all sorts of languages. So if you're willing to help, please do so. And the last thing is OSC command that's been added, which is the set super source box source command. So this is a way for you to set up your companion stream deck button so that you can instantly set a source to for a box. So if you say, you know, I want box one to be camera one, or I want it to be camera 20, uh, you can do that now from OSC. And that's it. All the features in Mix Effect 1.1.1. It's a small release, but I think one that has a lot of features that I think you're going to love. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe below if you haven't done so already. I'm getting really close to a thousand subscribers. I know in the grand scheme of things, a thousand subscribers on YouTube is like, what? These guys have like millions of subscribers, but every subscriber counts and I appreciate you following me. 
I'll have more videos on Mix Effect in the coming weeks as I work on new features. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye.